going on YouTube? <laughs> well, had to go on a recovery mission this morning for number seven, Texas Tech. Seeing we had a little trouble, boss man called, he was running and started smoking from the left front. Thought he had a wheel bearing go out on the left front steer tire, so had to drive over there about 80 miles away, not about 90 miles away. Go pick it up, load it up on our low boy, on our RGM, and brought it home. And, well, I'll show y'all what we got. Your wheel's supposed to roll, everybody knows. That one's pretty, it's pretty hard. But it ain't supposed to do this. That is a no-no. So probably what happened here, there's a nut back here on the spindle. Probably come loose. And the nut's probably laying inside this oil, uh, this oil housing right here in the cap here. And it's probably backed off. If we're lucky, it just got the bearings. If we're not lucky, it got the spindle as well. And by I mean lucky, not lucky, bearings are easy to replace. Spindles, they get kind of expensive. And it's a lot more, a little, little more of a process to change it out. So I'm going to tear it down here and we're going to see what we got, what happened. So y'all hang out with me. I'm going to put you to the side and uh, we'll do time lapse through this and we'll get her did. 806 driver, b, &B trucking. Keep your eye on it. Right there, right there, 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 there. No, right here. No. your rollers in and all this is debris from the bearing so I'm about to clean it up
had here was outboard bearing failure. This is your bearing right here. It's seized up on the spindle right now. So I'm gonna, I don't know if I'm gonna have to cut it off or if I can be able to just knock it off, knock the heck out of it. The inboard bearing is still on here. Still looks good, but it didn't come out. The seal, the wheel seal and the bearing, the inboard bearing stayed in place on the spindle too. So might be a little fun getting everything off, but I'm gonna get it all cleaned up and all disassembled. <laughs>
probably had to get my puller after it to get it off. Spindle's boogered right here just a little bit. But uh I think it's I think it's salvageable. I'm gonna I'm gonna take everything or clean everything up real good, get the other bearing off of there. We should be able to what the heck? We should be able to uh, salvage this thing. So I should have got the puller from the get go instead of jacking with that cut off wheel and the torch. But probably still would have had to put the torch on it and get a little heat on that uh, bearing. That bearing, uh, inside bearing housing. It was on there though. The spindle is shot, so I should be able to take this spindle loose. There's four bolts right here, four over here. Should be able to take those loose, and the spindle will come off along along with the uh, along with the S cam. So the S cam shaft. So that's what we're gonna do next. Tear it down.
lot of YouTube. Got it all tore down. I we'll have to replace the spindle, keen pins. Of course, I had to take the keen pin out to get the spindle off. Um, of course, probably put a new drag link while we got it off. One little bearing failure messes up a lot of stuff. But hey, we got it done. We got it tore down. see here yeah got her all tore down there so that'd be it for me i got a track meet son's got his first track meet of the year junior year tomorrow He'll be running the 100 the sprint relay and long jump so hoping he can break into the tens this year in the 100 he should hopefully be able to run 10 9 10 8 this year um hopefully over that 20 foot mark then long jump, so it'll be good. Um, yeah, I got the track meet tomorrow, and then Sunday, I gotta go back to Georgia. We got a, another load of fertilizer I gotta take out there to Georgia, so I got some Mississippi footage. Should that video should be done before I get this one out, but this one and the Mississippi should be pretty much back to back, and then I'll get a little bit on the Georgia run. But anyway, for 806 driver, BB trucking. We'll catch you on the next one. Every single day.